TikTok, an app known for its quirky short videos, is facing political heat because of its ties to China. Owned by ByteDance, a tech company based in Beijing, TikTok's popularity has exploded over the past year. It's got a new boost from the coronavirus pandemic, drawing in users looking to escape the boredom quarantine. The app has been downloaded more than 2 billion times. According to research firm Sensor Tower, they have 263 million coming during the first half of this year. India is its first large, largest market, followed by Brazil and the U.S. TikTok isn't available in China, where ByteDance distributes a domestic version called Doyen. And that's the crazy part because the United States government, well, the Trump administration, as a matter of fact, wanted to ban apps related to China because more likely, I think they're the the only reason they're doing that is because Trump has a hate relationship with China. That is why he wants to ban TikTok. Now, it says here that now TikTok's growth is under fire because governments are concerned about Chinese government. And the Chinese government might have swayed over the app, citing national security concerns. India banned TikTok last week. The U.S. and in Australia are also considering blocking the app. The U.S. Army and Navy have banned service members from downloading the app to government-issued phones. Even Amazon has raised concerns. On Friday, the huge online retailer barred employees from using the app on the devices that connect to the company's emails, citing security risks. And politicians are worried that the Chinese government could use the video app to spy on U.S. citizens. In an interview with Fox News aired on Monday, Secretary of State Mike Pompeo said that users who downloaded the app are putting private Im information in the hands of the Chinese Communist Party. President Donald Trump said it a different reason for a potential TikTok ban punishing China for its response to the coronavirus. Ask about Trump Fayol's remarks in an interview with Greek television, Trump confirmed the U.S. is considering a TikTok ban. It's big business, Trump said. Look what happened to China with this virus. What they've done to the country and to the entire world is disgraceful. It's unclear how likely a ban would be, but unless say it won't be easy to implement. The U.S. Department of State declined to provide any additional information. The White House didn't immediately have a comment. Yeah, so exactly because the Trump administration they unfortunately don't have evidence about it. And if they did, they would have shown us the evidence. Because TikTok is led by an American CEO and they have never provided user data to Chinese government more would they do so if asked.
and if tr the Trump administration actually had evidence about it, well, they they would have shown the the actual reason for it, but since they just want to. And tick tock for no reason. Then you completely believed in Donald Trump, which means that you believed in his lies. And if you believed in his lies, then you're not an American. If you really want to like try and and believe Donald Trump well try doing that again because today is Friday and more importantly um by the time I'm recording this, as you can see, TikTok is still here. It hasn't been banned like it was supposed to be this Friday. And, you know, by the time the Trump administration does something, they actually won't. And if they don't ban TikTok today or the next couple of weeks, then we all know. Then we all know why they call, call a bluff on banning to talk in the first place.